guys welcome back to another magical video so I was just posing for a little thumbnail right now but anyways let's get into our witches moon box opening for August 2019 I'm so excited guys I love this box so much and let's get into it I think after this I'm gonna show you some things I bought for Halloween as well too Ooh. so let's get this baby open I've been waiting to open it Ooh. It's looking magical and voodoo already. Let's see. So the first like book art page is the Solemn Protector. Cyrus, Pl I can't even read the writing. It's so magical. I have to take some time to look it up, or I mean to like just like take it in, like to code the words. But what? This is so magical, guys. This looks like the um corn doll that I was trying to make that like was a flop. <laughs> In the like I was telling you guys, expectation versus like reality, my corn doll versus like their doll that they made, but all about the wisdom and power of the ancestors, you know. The Lunasad Lamas video. Oh, it's the sage doll's a protective guardian meant to be placed near or at a significant threshold, entrances to the home, hearth or heart of the home settled, at a staircase, landing or even overlooking a nearby gateway or walkway. Sage is naturally imbued with roasting, purifying, healing and protective energies of the earth earth and air. I hope they have this doll already made in here for me, guys. Ooh, it smells good. It feels good. There's like a sigil in the corner down there. I don't know if you guys can see it with the lighting, but it's like a pinnacle or a pentagram, I mean, with the um, Viking visigor symbol. Ooh, that's so magical. And we got a little info card I'll show you guys later with a little tarot card for the month. And there's a little cute feather on it. My message is P-H-E-A-S-A-N-T, pheasant. So that's the bird, the pheasant bird. It says, the time is ripe for creation and connection. Focus your attention in these areas. So this is perfect. I've been doing my best to try to live in the present a little bit more. And I got my manifestation spell in the corner and doing a lot of manifestation. So it's like it's time, the time is ripe for creation and connection. That's good. I like this message, guys, because it's Lionsgate right now. I went ahead, tuned into the energy, already feeling the magic working and all the negativity leaving my body, mind, body, and soul with my big citrine sphere. I did a little ritual with Sage Goddess, everything is doing good so i love that little message from them okay let's get in here and enough with the blabbering oh my god they have a sage doll in here what this is so cute guys how funny of course i try to make one it doesn't work so i end up getting one from the universe how funny i should show you guys on my altar which is moon sage doll compared to mine this is so freaking cute guys and like if you wanted to you could eventually burn this and like cleanse your home but i get the message of what they're saying there Oh, a little sage guardian protector. This is reminding me of the guardians in the moor from like Maleficent. Totally from that realm. It's giving me that vibe. This is so freaking cute. I love this, guys. This sage doll is so cute. Thank you, Witch's Moon. I love this box. I'm so happy I bought it this month. I love that. And we got some witchy herbs. <gasps> I've never had witch's tea from them before, guys. I've always seen people um, unbox it and they have witch's tea. So I'm so happy to have some of that. This one is Witch's Sight Herbal Tea. I love that. And this one is Belzema Herb. And ooh, there's more stuff in here. There's all this like stuffing on top. There's a candle, more herb, little pouch. Let's see what's in here. Looks like a crystal or maybe it could be a necklace. I love how these pouches feel like silk. They feel so cool. Oh, it's a desert rose. Like, this is such a cool box, guys. I think this... Let's see the theme. What is the theme about? I'm going to try not to spoil everything, but... It's the Witch's Guardian as the name of the theme about this month's box. And the paper's yellow instead. I kind of like how they did that, guys. Because it's like Lunasad Lamas right now. And tuning into that... Um, summer energy meets autumnal energy soon. Like, what? I'm so happy to have a piece of desert rose. If you guys don't know, I actually also have a piece of raw selenite at the foot of my bed to keep away that negative energy. So, this is that crystal, guys, in another form, and it's the desert rose. I've never had a piece and I've always wanted one, so I'm so happy to have a piece of that. Love that crystal. It's self-cleansing, angelic energy from the higher realm, so it's all good vibes all around. 
Oh, I was like, what's this? Duh, it's a little tea bag, so I can go ahead and brew my tea. And the tea, what was the tea even about? I don't even know what I'm doing right now, guys. It's called the Witch's Sight Herbal Tea, so we'll read more about that later. And there's something big right here. Let's get into this. Ooh. What? Is this what I think it is? Is it like a pentagram, pentacle kind of vibe thing? With a witchy brew? I've ne I don't really have a pentagram, guys, or a pentacle. Like, I don't have any of it in jewelry or anything. Not that I don't love it. Literally, my past life being a high priestess in the House of Night lifetime and other ones, I've used it. But I don't have an actual pentagram or pentacle and now I do this is so cute and there's a little thing on it guys so you can put it like on the front of your door on your wall and hang it up this is so cute so witchy and so this time of year with the little broom on it I love this so much I totally don't think I would buy it if I like saw it in the store but like um I don't mind it this is cute for this season to like have it up on my altar and it's got the witch's brooms like I love it I think it's cute and of course me, I'd be the one to make it into a necklace. Oh, that's cool. Let's see what the oil is for the month, guys. And it should read you some little blurbs from the paper so we know more about the stuff for this month. I did hear that the Witches Moon on their Instagram, they worked so hard on this box. It was like, took them a long time to like create it. So a little bit more history on the Sage doll. It's the Solemn Protector doll. This beautiful protector has been handmade from blue sage, ooh, a different kind of sage, ethically sourced from a repute farm adorned with bark. With this powerful doll, it has been fastened together solely to bring you and your loved ones protection from all evil energy and beings, also known as the Grandmother Sage. Blue sage carries protective and cleansing energies, bringing peace of mind into the area it resides. I'm already getting goosebumps guys like truth bumps from the other side about what they're saying the blue doll is a protective guardian meant to be placed near our significant thresholds entrances to the home the hearth or the heart of the home settled at a staircase landing or even overlooking a nearby gateway or walkway blue sage is naturally imbued with robusting purifying healing and protective energies of the gateway or walkway oh i love how this has grandmother protective energy i feel those vibes love it guys i'll include the close-up clips to um give you guys a little bit more info and about the book of shadows art it has been they've been partnered with a very talented local artist to create an exclusive piece of art in the honor of the sage doll that is included within this collection and the little elemental plaque elemental besom pinnacle plaque we have included this unique elemental besom pinnacle plaque to bring additional protection into your sacred space used over many centuries and cultures for the magical per purposes the pinnacle or the five-pointed star represents the elements these elements include earth air fire water and spirit everyone doesn't talk about spirit i don't know why it's so annoying it's like the most important element it connects you to vine to source the god who created everything and this sacred symbol is commonly used within wiccan and neo-pagan traditions as a potent symbol of protection this symbol can be placed around your home workplace and self as it as they see fit the specific pinnacle interpretation refers to the cleansing protective properties of the besom used to sweep away negative energy and stagnant energy use this plaque among your altar above doorways or in a sacred space to bring energy of protection and wisdom into your surroundings i would love to put this above my door guys this is so cute i totally forgot duh the broom sweeps away negative energy and you can sweep on a hollow's eve and tap into that magical energy so this is castaway magical anointing oil. Oh, I can't wait to smell it. There's lavender in here. You know I'm gonna love it. Um, castaway magical anointing oil. We have created this magical anointing oil with the intention of providing you with immediate relief from unwanted and negative energies. This castaway oil is a great addition to your daily experience. Carry this oil with you throughout the day when negative people or energy comes near or starts to affect you. Simply place a small amount on the selected charka centers we have enhanced this magical oil with lavender clove myrrh and cedar wood oils we have included sage and lavender as well inside your oil to find oh inside your oil you will find a lemurian cord set to personify oneness within your aura we have also included a special mixture of our fast feast magical oil from our personal cabinet of witchery into this mixture of this oil be careful when applying to skin the base of this oil is sunflower oil some might be more sensitive than others when in contact with skin external use only Oh, this is so cool, guys. I love this. And I forgot to mention, like, the sage doll, this. Like, this kit is, like, amazing because, like, negative energy entities, demons always attack me because of who I am and what I do. Like, 
I bring magic into this realm. I'm bringing magic from other worlds here. I am like vanquishing evil stuff. I'm guiding people along their path, awakening them to their truth. And their karma evil stuff don't like it. So I need all the protection I can get. And I love brewing my own things. But like I don't mind getting my own fun things too. Like this is so fun guys. I get so excited every month to open this box. Because it's like something magical in this realm. In this world. It gets me so excited and I'm so happy. It smells good. This smells more like um, earthy. Ooh. And when I smell it in. I get a little like western tang in there. Like, ooh, I can smell some cedar. Ooh, there's depth and there's layers into this, guys. And it's like, it honestly feels like how I felt last night when I did my ritual with that citrine spirit. I feel like refreshed, like rejuvenated, like cleansed, like on a deep level. Like a deep cleansing. Like, this is good. May not be my favorite scent, but like the properties like of what I need is great. And you can anoint your candle with this oil. Like, I love it. And ooh, what is the bath salt? Um, Maybon Sacred Salt. Ooh, and it looks like it's got like Mother Earth on there. I love this. Um, this is perfect. I'm already out of my other um, witchy salt for Lama. So this one is... Maybon is an absolute time of celebration and excitement. A sacred time of Thanksgiving. Maybon provides us with the opportunity to show your gratitude to others, including showing gratitude for the prosperity and abundance you currently have. This time of celebration also comes with the practice of introspecting, giving yourself sacred time to truly look at the blessings that have been provided to you. We have created the sacred salt with the intention of celebrating the sacred time of year, relax and let go of a preconceived thoughts and expectations allow your inner shadow to slowly stop cluttering your emotions visualize what the coming months are going to look like allow time to bask in the beauty of your fortune we have enhanced this sacred salt with frankincense chamomile and myrrh oils as well as yarrow and passion flower herbs we have also included a special mixture of our own maybon celebration magical oil from our own personal cabinet of witchery in the making of the sacred salt and a little bit about the tea since i saw about the tea on here guys the tea is Witches Sight Ritual Herbal Tea with Muslin Bag. This clarifying ritual herbal tea is made of chamomile and peppermint created to break through the distraction that is commonly unrest within our thoughts and spirit. As you sip this lovely blend during the ritual of meditation, allow your stress to slowly slip away, bringing clarity to your perspective. This herbal blend allows your psychic sight to awaken, allow to decipher and understand messages more clearly. I love this, guys. This is cute. It says to let it steep for four minutes. I'm going to be doing my full moon ritual today, guys, so... For breakfast, I haven't had breakfast yet. I'm totally gonna brew that tea. And oh my god, I'm so itchy everywhere right now. Lastly, guys, we got our candle. We have another herb. This herb is Devil's ne Needle. De this Devil's Needle herb, guys, is actually Yarrow. This is amazing. I have a little bit too. I love this herb. I want to grow this plant. It's cute and amazing. and has so much history with me in my past life. So Yarrow is one of the most ancient medical plants used as far back as the time of ancient Egyptians and Greeks. Love that. Known for a multitude of cures, Yarrow has relied upon herb. Yarrow was a heavily relied upon herb for physical aid, used in our craft to bring forth positive people and energies. Yarrow can also expel negative energies from a person or place. Yarrow is also carried throughout the day to cast a net of protection over your aura, bring courage and eliminating fear. Gender is feminine, planetary connection, Venus, elemental connection, water, magical properties of love, courage, protection, and exorcism. So this is a little spell candle for the month, guys. I love their spell candles. I have one behind me that I'm using for my ritual over there. So this one... Ooh, it's so cute. It's yellow and it's got a spell on it. So this candle is all about... It's hand-rolled, the Garden Harvest spell candle. We have hand-rolled and charged this candle with the purpose of bringing protection to your home and harvest. This can include family and personal items that hold a special bond within your spirit. As you sit with this flame, focus only on the protected barrier that you wish to create. The purpose of this candle is to break through the ego, allowing yourself to let go of unwanted thoughts and emotions that you may have towards those that try to harm you. Allow the natural ingredients within this candle to direct you in receiving necessary messages during your meditations and rituals. As you connect with the grounded energy from this candle, bring your sense to the here and now, recognizing the in intimate beauty that connects you to all things around you. This candle has been enhanced with frankincense oil and we have also included a mixture of our own bounty magic oil from our personal cabinet of witchery into the rolling of this candle. This candle is wrapped with a parchment spell from our from our book of shadows that we have. Oh that's so cool. So they've included their own book of shadow spell into this like little magical um 
thing. This is so cute. I love their little spell candles and doing these cute little spells, guys. I can't wait to read the spell and see what it looks like. Cute little beeswax candle. Like I say every time, guys, I love the value of this box. It is amazing. They also have incense for this month. Mmm, this smells totally of what you would think of Lamas Luna Soft when you describe, or when people describe the holiday on YouTube, when you like read about it and you learn about the holiday. Like, this is that smell, this is that vibe. You guys know this down to the T. I love this so much. This is. Let's see where the incense is. Um, I can't find it, but long story short, mmm. This incense smells like llamas. It smells amazing. I'm sure that's supposed to be more um, for like Maybon, but maybe the next box will be more dedicated towards Maybon. But I love this, guys. It's amazing. I saw June Mermaid's video of the Roots box this month, and I'm like, oh my god, I wish I got it with the cute little pentacle, um, pentagram little like charm, wind charm. I was like, what? The wind charm looks so cute. But long story short, guys, I love everything. It's, like, amazing. I did hear that some people didn't like this month's box, and I don't get it. Like, I love it. This is so freaking cute. This goes back to our witch's roots, like, our ancestry from our past lives to our present life. Like, the strength and wisdom of, like, women and the witches from the past, as well as, like, what they're saying with um, the witch's moon, that this is like a protective talisman. So like, it's so cool. And I'm getting more of like a masculine energy from this one. And like, this is so cool. Like I got tea to like make me be stabilized and like in the present and receive messages. I got protective oil, like my go-to oil I'm gonna be using. Like yummy incense. I got a cute little penna, pentagram, pinnacle. I forget, pentagram, pentacle, one has the circle around it. But this is so cute and witchy. Like, I love everything from this month's Witches Moon Box, guys. I'm so happy I'm subscribed. I can't wait to see what next month brings. And yeah, this was such a surprise. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, turn on those post notifications down below to be notified for future videos, guys. And without further ado, by earth, by air, by fire, by water, by spirit, in the name of God, it's next me, guys. Be blessed and rejuvenated, so mode it be. I've heard a story, I've heard it said I've come to believe that love is a bet Sometimes you win it, sometimes you lose it Sometimes it calls you right in the move Come to my table, come to my bed, go easy my home Also talk about my necklaces guys. I got this from their witch's moon box and this one from their witch's bounty box which is the aqua aura quartz and they just pair so good together that like moon energy. I just love it. It's amazing. Definitely check them out down below guys.